Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to be talking about and reviewing Wild Planet Wild Pacific Sardines in extra virgin olive oil. And they are lightly smoked. So um, if you see off to the side here, I have some other sardines. Um, I, I I just finished recording a video um, <clears throat> a, a video about uh, Henry and Lisa's sardines and talking about how they were. So you might want to go back and check that. I'll, I'll have that published at the same time as this video. But I reviewed, I ate about half of what was there, and I'm going to be comparing these, but not in this video. So this video is going to be all about Wild Planet. And um, we're, we're, these are these are the normal, I normally buy these just because they're relatively high quality. Um, there's definitely a difference in quality in different brands of sardines. And these are pretty good quality, and they're actually available at Costco, believe it or not. So um, you usually... I'm getting these just because they're convenient to pick up and, um, you know, <clears throat> they are pretty good quality. Now, the other brand in the previous video I just recorded, uh, Henry and Lisa's, you might want to go check that video out, go check my list of videos. I'm going to put a link to it in the description, but um, those are, um, those I picked those up at, at uh, Whole Foods and they're also pretty good. And you can also get Wild Planet at Whole Foods. So you can get both of these at Whole Foods and you can get these at Costco. Um, the other the other sardines, um, I, I think they're slightly better, but I'm going to compare. So opening these up, yeah, the, the color is a little different. They just look, um, they look like they're, they look fatter and like they're, they're not as flat. So, um, it's a little different, but, uh, I'm going to take these out and, um, yeah, the skin is not peeling off them the same way. I'm gonna give this a try. All right, so <clears throat> let's try these out. Yeah, so right away, um, stronger flavor and they're drier. So the actual meat, even though they're soaking in, in olive oil, the actual, it hasn't penetrated the meat as well, or, or they, just don't have enough of their own oil. One way or another, the actual meat is, is drier. And I think you, you can almost guess about that based on, um, maybe it has to do with how thick these are. Um, they're vaguely the same. The other the other sardines were like, um, they're, they're, they're higher this way and um, they're slightly shorter and slightly fatter. So they, they were more moist inside. So this, this is good. Um, but this is not as, uh, it's not as, um, it's kind of a stronger flavor, but it's not as, um, it, it's drier and not as good as the, uh, <clears throat> so th this is the wild planet and this is not as good as the, uh, Henry and Lisa's, um, sardines. So I think Henry and Lisa's are slightly better. They're both vaguely comparable, but those are slightly better. So I'm going to bring these both on camera real quick just so you can see. And I almost feel like this could have been one video, <clears throat> but you'll, you'll notice, see, these are, these are like longer and they're fatter like this way, but they're not as spread out like this. Let's see, these are, I don't know if you can tell with this camera angle, but these are more like prep, more flat and one way or another. So, um, yeah, Henry and Lisa's wild planet. So yeah, definitely. I mean, Wild Planet is great. I have them all the time. Um, oftentimes I'll be eating them with hot sauce or something like that. Um, they are drier than Henry and Lisa's, so I'm more apt to want to eat these with hot sauce rather than eat them plain. They still taste great plain. Um, you will get tired of them if you eat them every day. But um, yeah, there you go. Final verdict. I would say the others are, are slightly better, but that all comes down to personal preference. Mm. Still pretty good though. <clears throat> so um, you might want to give me a thumbs up. Um, leave a comment down below if you've tried these. If you have your own opinion, let let it let it, let me and let everyone else know what what you thought about this. If you know something I don't know, leave a comment down below. Not just for me, but for the next person who thumbs along. Um, you don't want to hit that subscribe button if you want more food related content like this. Um, we do a lot of things. We go out to restaurants. We uh, we buy different products at the store. We try different hot sauces, different cheeses. 
Um, we show you how to cook things, all different stuff. So you're not going to want to miss all this content. We, we've put a lot out already. You might want to check it out. And we have a lot more coming up. So you're not going to want to miss it. Hit that subscribe button. Hit the little bell icon. And um, that's, that's about it for today. So as always, thanks for watching. And we will see you on the next video.